This episode brought to you by Noble Gold. Check out this free offer from my viewers. Ask yourself, are you on the investment treadmill? You know what I mean, saving and saving and saving cash for retirement. Well, guess what? That savings isn't gonna be worth much by the time you retire. Cash is trash. You have to make money work for you. If you feel like this could be the answer for you, call the team at Noble Gold, take out a qualifying IRA this month, and they'll gift you a solid gold, 22 karat, 1 10th ounce American Eagle bullion coin. Visit our website now at the link you can find in the description or pinned comment. Go right now and check out this free American Eagle gold coin offer. Okay, those father. So, yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, hang on. So, oh my God! Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Going Insane with Drone Tech. If you're anything like me, you definitely don't watch SNL and probably didn't see the latest episode this weekend with Elon Musk. They're a bunch of unfunny partisan hacks who only see fit to mock Republicans or Republican presidents, never ever their dear leaders in the communist, I, I mean Democrat party. It's not funny and the cringy skits just go on and on, which makes me feel uncomfortable. It's basically just a propaganda organ for the extreme left. Hilariously, the washed up hacks on SNL actually refuse to be seen with Elon Musk or some other such nonsense that we We've come to expect from the woke supremacists. I really should have watched it just based on that alone. Now, I don't agree with everything Elon Musk says, but he is trying to get human beings to Mars, and for that, I'll always be a fan. So anyway, he goes on SNL, and he says a bunch of things that has the left screeching, but what I found most hilarious was their reaction to him giving the okay sign. No doubt an act of trolling. This has, of course, sent the woke supremacists into convulsions. <laughs> It's so weird to me that these people instantly assume that he's making the white power sign. Why? What has Musk ever done to make people think he's part of a violent racist gang? He could have just as easily been making the 666 sign, which by the way, somebody else has already accused him of. So which is it? Is he making the white power sign or the Satan sign or is he just trolling? One of the best reactions came from this unhinged blue check mark, quote, freelance writer and editor named Daisy Banger saying, quote, wait, what? Did Elon Musk just like aggressively flash the white power sign during the weekend update? Please tell me I'm insane. Please, no, really, going to need you to tell me I'm insane. Oh, don't worry, we will. You are certifiably batshit insane. And I have no doubt that you're gonna follow this tweet up with further proof. Definitely never thought Saturday Night Live would send me into a tornado of existential despair, but here we are. I almost don't have words, but I will say that I hope his Tesla catches on fire and he dies. <laughs> What? <laughs> okay, not only are you definitely insane, but you may have just committed a crime. Well, probably not a crime, but she is wishing a horrible, painful death on a person for the high crime of making an innocuous hand gesture that no doubt all of her most favorite people are also guilty of using. I'd show you more of this crazy person's ranting, but she made her profile private. Probably a good move. How does this person still have a blue check mark? I mean, how does she still even have an account? I was banned from Twitter for saying that one of the people pictured inside the Capitol on January 6th carrying a rebel flag should be executed, which was obviously a joke I was making towards all the people calling for their heads. But this blue check mark can post something like that and there's no ban hammer from Twitter? Well, of course not, because as we all know, these rules are really just justifications for them to silence their political opinion. Opponents. Some other blue check marks weighed in on Elon's heinous act, saying, quote, It seems the defense of white power signs is that the people who see it are crazy conspiracy theorists who can't recognize an old fashioned contorted OK symbol. Not sure why they think Elon Musk was flashing OKs. Elon Musk did the white power hand gesture during a weekend update, twice with each hand. NBC got Norm out of that desk for way less. Times are changing, I guess. This whole white supremacy thing is very retro. <laughs> all right, folks, that's all I have for this one. Just wanted to cheer up your Monday with a little woke madness. If I've done my job, please hit that like button, and I'll see you all tomorrow.